ensuring inclusive education it is uh, also part of sdg4 and we see that uh, significant progress has been made through different programs just like uh, education for all as well as the millennium, millennium development goals isme kafi progress zarur hui hai lekin uh, uh, that's not enough it is uh, not sufficient lot more to be done we still see there are lots of inequalities among countries we see that national averages in many countries uh, let's say hide the striking inequalities within uh, countries in levels of attainment and outcome of basic education or uh, isme children with disabilities uh, are mostly very often uh, overlooked or ek bada important jo factor hai wo gender inequality ka hai hum koshish kar rahe hain ke gender equality ki taraf move kare uh, efforts de- definitely ho rahi hain lekin iske bawajood we see that majority of uh, uh, out of school children are girls while two thirds of the youth and adults with low levels of literacy in the world are also women to is silsile mein uh, ke agar hum ye chahte hain to help uh, empowerment of the women so men as well as the boys must also be engaged in the fight against gender in- inequality it is not simply the job of the women to fight for equality and empowerment it is uh, actually the men as well as uh, the young population the boys who should come for- forward for this mission so traditional factors of marginalization in education such as gender urban or rural residents uh, continue to combine with income language minority status and disability to create mutually reinforcing disadvantages particularly in low income or conflict affected countries to ek factor nahi hai jab ye combine ho jate hain to iska ek cumulative interaction as well as cumulative effect bhi hame nazar aa raha hai तो जहां हम ये समझते हैं कि एजुकेशन हैज द पोटेंशियल टू इक्वलाइज वहां हमें ये भी नजर आता है कि प्रोड्यूसेस इन इक्वालिटीज बट सर्टनली वी आर फोकसिंग ऑन एजुकेशन एज 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 ए मींस टू इक्वालिटी तो इंक्लूसिव एजुकेशन प्रोसेसेस आर इसेंशियल फॉर इक्विटेबल डेवलपमेंट एंड दिस अपीयर्स टू बी ट्रू फॉर various levels of uh, educational provision yahan baat uh, kare to different stages agar education ki dekhe to early childhood education jo hai that's important to ye jo hame researches batati hain ke early interventions for young children are essential not only for their own well being but they are they also have sustainable long term effects on the development of human capital social cohesion and economic success to uske usme ko foundation jo hai wo is kism ki banti hai ke it becomes uh, let's say very important for sustainability of uh, the development so we see ke khas taur par डिसएडवांटेज चिल्ड्रन को अगर इस किस्म का मौका मिलता है तो अर्ली चाइल्डहुड का तो उसके बहुत ज़्यादा असरा हमें नज़र आते हैं लेकिन इसके बावजूद हम देखते हैं कि ये प्रोग्राम जो हैं इतने इफ़ेक्टिव हमें नज़र नहीं आते तो इंटरवीनिंग अर्लियर रिक्वायर्स प्योर रिसोर्स एंड लेस एफर्ट एट द सेम टाइम इट इज़ मोर इफेक्टिव इसके बाद अगर देखें सेकेंडरी एजुकेशन को तो एक्सपेंशन ऑफ एक्सेस टू बेसिक स्कूलिंग वर्ल्ड वाइड हैज इंक्रीज डिमांड फॉर सेकेंडरी एंड टर्सरी एजुकेशन एंड कंसर्न फॉर वोकेशनल स्किल डेवलपमेंट क्योंकि लोअर लेवल पे 
प्राइमरी स्कूल लेवल पर या बेसिक एजुकेशन की लेवल पर बहुत ज़्यादा एम्फोसाइज किया जा रहा है ऑल ओवर द वर्ल्ड इन ऑल ऑल द कंट्रीज वी सी लॉट ऑफ प्रोग्रेस हैज़ बीन मेड अब ये जब यहाँ प्रोग्रेस नज़र आती है तो वी एक्सपेक्ट दैट देर विल बी डिमांड फॉर सेकेंडरी एजुकेशन एज वेल क्योंकि ये लोग जो हैं दे बिकम लेट्स से अवेयर ऑफ द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ एजुकेशन देन दे गो हैव द हाई एस्पिरेशन एंड देन दे गो फॉर सेकेंडरी एजुकेशन सो द एक्सपेंशन ऑफ पोस्ट बेसिक एजुकेशनल अपॉर्चुनिटीज कम्बाइंड विद प्रो पुअर पब्लिक पॉलिसीज है शोन टू रिड्यूस इन इक्वालिटी तो उसमें लोग आगे चलते हैं investment in education labor market institutions and regulations can change patterns of inequality so uske liye hum ye bhi mangte hain ki there has to be increase in public expenditure on education so ye uske sath connected hai higher education ki baat kare to wahan par hum dekhte hain ki the access to higher education has shown a a spectacular expansion over the past 15 years global enrollment in tertiary education has doubled since 2000 with today some 200 million students worldwide uh, half of whom are women so isme bahut zyada expansion hui hai uh, basic education mein bhi hui hai lekin aage bhi hui hai however we see that there are lots of uh, disparities aur ye disparities kiske base pe aa rahi hain income ke base pe aa rahi hain aur uske sath hi dusri cheeze ethnicity aa aa sakti hai other discrimination aa sakti hai so we also see that there is lot of uh, social marginal marginalization and that continues to persist so we see that uh, uh, learners from higher income groups have retained their relative advantage in access to tertiary ed- education all over the world ye pehle bhi baat hai ki tertiary education jo hai ye uh, well off uh, logon ke liye well off uh, bachchon ke liye hai the people who can afford to pay the fees because this is not something which is compulsory which is not necessary that may be considered as a luxury so therefore those who can afford they might go over there so we see that in even in countries with high enrollment rates the participation of minorities continue to lag behind the national average in these uh, uh, let's say tertiary education jisme aap university level ki education ki baat kar sakte hain so most of the growth in higher education has been uh, and continues to be in the private sector aur jab private sector ki baat karenge to ye koi ala vaaste logon ko education nahi dete particularly at this level uh, many a times this private sector might be uh, taking this uh, let's say mission not mission but uh, as a as a business so usme they have to make the money make the profit aur agar ye approach hai to wohi aayenge who could pay for this education aur ye jo uh, trend hai privatization ka of uh, let's say tertiary education is the inequality mein uh, increase hone ka zyada implications hain so therefore we see that uh, public sector may have to come forward for uh, giving access uh, to let's say everybody as well as uh, looking after the equity of the uh, of the people